Hello, welcome to Tech Shenmit. In this session, we will discuss one more toolbar option for Access Client solution, which is for keyboard mapping. So for that, you need to locate this option on your screen. So once you take your mouse here, it will show the description, remote, uh, remap keyboard functions. So just click here. Then it will open this screen from where you will find some categories like characters. If you want to assign keys to some character, you can assign from here. We have macros. If there are some macros, you can assign keys to macros as well. Host functions. Similarly, we have custom functions. If there is any custom function, menu commands. Okay. Now I will tell you, uh, like how we can assign keys to these. Okay. So first of all, we will discuss the requirements. So suppose we are working on multiple session and uh, very quickly we want to move from one session to another session without clicking or without using mouse so for that we will set up the key so to set up the key what you can do you can open this window and from here just go to the category host functions and from there you will find one option for uh, move to session or jump to session so you can see here it is mentioned jump to session A now how we will assign this key for now you can see that we have already assigned this key but I will again tell you like how to assign this screen so firstly just select that option for which you want to assign the key then click on assign a key and press the key from your keyboard which you want to assign so I will press ctrl and shift again so you can see it is showing me a message we are reassigning this to session A so just click on yes so it is added similarly if I want to assign any key to session C so I will select here make assign key and control 1 so what it will do it whenever I press control 1 it will move to session C if you want to um, means unassign any key you can simply select this and just click on unassign key so it is unassigned similarly I will make a unassign for jump to B as well so from this we have added a key let me clear this one unassign now we will set the key for session B because we are on session A so from session A we want to move to session B so select this click on assign key and press ctrl shift make sure that whatever the key you are using it should be unique because otherwise it will affect your code let's say if I assign anything to shift A so at the time of writing code when I press shift A for writing capital A it will change my session so it, you should only use only those keys which are not uh, which are rarely used like sh control shift uh, control tilde or back quote okay so here we assign it as a control shift now click on save and simply click on ok so from here if I press control shift you can see now I am on session B right again go back to session A press control sh uh, shift it is on session B so this will save our time at the time of development we can simply click these keys and it will um, navigate us from one session to another similar thing we will do here also just go for function keys host functions search for that key from this session we want to move from session B to session A so here I will assign the key as okay so by here it is already a set as control shift so you can see we can navigate with same key because for each session we have changed to session A means here we have assigned control shift for moving to session B and for this session we have assigned uh, control shift for moving from session B to session A so as per your requirement you can assign any key there are many options like delete character clear field jump to session A to Z move okay so whatever the thing you want to assign you can simply assign and one more thing like if you want to search for a, a particular key like where it is used so you can press con search for key control V so if I type control V so it will show me which menu command is assigned with this control V similarly if I want to search for control A so it will show like control A is assigned to select all so this is very good feature like from here you can easily find if there is any key other than uh, like if there is any key we have already assigned or not so you can search from here from custom keys you can add the custom keys and if you want to reset all your uh, configuration you can reset by clicking on reset and just click on yes okay if you are using any keyboard file option 
then you can go and you can select your keyboard file from navigation or by default it is on current selection so mainly this option we use in order to assign some keys to uh, the functions so that we can easily perform our task so i hope this part is clear to all of you in the next part we will discuss few more things so thank you for watching tech channel